Hey there planners, it's Sarah here, Creating with Sarah. In today's video, I have a small collective planner haul. I have purchased some things here and there. Um, so if you guys wanna check out this planner haul, then keep on watching. So welcome back, I'm Sarah, all things creating, planning, yet keeping things fun and functional. And today I have for you a small collective haul of things that I've picked up online and in store. So this is just a cute little bin that I keep under my desk. That way I put everything in here that can fit that I've ordered so I can share in a uh, collective haul for you guys. Okay, so uh, mainly I have things from Hobby Lobby, Erin Condren, Happy Planner that I've ordered online, and then an Etsy small shop um, sticker order. Okay, and Michaels. So first, from Michaels, I have three stickers from their little end caps. So in my Michaels store, they have like these little end caps that are like 99 cents and they're these cute little sticker packs. So I, perfect for spring. So I have this uh, butterfly here. It has some gold foiling to it. And these are really nice because I know I can use these up real quick. Um, so I have this one here that I saw, it was really pretty. I have this cute little hedgehog. How cute is this one? These are really perfect for spring. And I really like that they have the foiling accents. So this one has gold foiling with the butterflies and this one has kind of like a copper foiling on the hedgehog's little spikes. It's so cute. And then this one is some snails and uh, little shells here that look like rainbows. And those have foiling accent with like a rose gold. So they're super cute. Um, it does say that they're new on here. They're probably just a new design, but they've had like these small grab little sticker sheets for a dollar. So I just thought these were really cute. They're cute find. Okay, my main reason why I went in is I had vouchers and I always try to save my vouchers for a particular item. And this is one of the new happy planner spring sticker books it's actually the only one that i've bought from the spring release and this is called cheerful season and this is one of uh like more of a seasonal sticker book but it's got more icons in it so i'll go ahead and flip through this really quickly um so my michaels has some of the stickers and a lot of more of the planners versus the stickers. So this was the last one left. And so we have like a winter collection with some boxes and then clear deco stickers. And these are all new illustrations, which I'm really excited about. That's why I purchased them. I've been using Happy Planner for quite a bit. So I have a lot of their stickers and I wanted something that was fresh and new. And this is a great one. So this is um, Valentine's and St. Patrick's Day. Ooh, this page would have been perfect for St. Patty's Day. That's really cute. I love that they're all new graphics. Okay, I have some boxes, some illustrations, and um, this is all paper stickers. These are all your functional stickers. Ooh, cute. So these are gonna be perfect for spring and Easter. We have like um, some gardening um, icon stickers, some butterflies and bugs. I really love these elements. I think it's kind of perfect. Then we roll into summer. Super cute with your boxes, paper. So it looks like all the boxes are paper and then we have a sheet of deco. And I'm noticing like a theme here as I'm flipping through this, the way it's set up. It seems a little different than how they usually do it. I love it. So here are the summer deco stickers, really cute, very beachy theme. Ooh, we have some more little icon stickers. These are paper, super cute. And then it looks like we have back to school stuff. So that's nice. And these are paper. And then we roll into fall. I love the fall. Super cute. Yeah, these are all new. 
illustrations. Oh, this is really cute. I love Halloween. It's my favorite. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. One year they did, um, or was it this past fall? They dedicated a book to just Halloween stickers. It was really cool. I love the cute icon stickers for Halloween. It's just so cutesy. No, I don't really celebrate Halloween. I've just always been, I love the festivities behind it. It's very nostalgic for me growing up. Um, we have some holiday stickers. These are all paper. I hope I was in frame for you guys, so I apologize. I'll kind of flip through it a little bit. Um, some deco holiday stickers, some more cute icon elements. And then we have some snowflakes. So this one's a really cute one. I'm really happy for purchasing this one and the fact that it has new graphics and illustrations. Super cute, cheerful seasons. So that's what I picked up at my Michaels. I wanted to, excuse me, I wanted to use my vouchers that I had saved up. Okay, so that was at Michaels. And um, I placed an order online with Happy Planner because I had accumulated a lot of rewards and I haven't used them. I think the last time I bought from Happy Planner was back in September of 20... 21, I think. So I decided to um, put in an order to use up my rewards. So what I got with my purchase is this cute little sticker. I think this is something new that they've been doing recently. It's super cute. So I guess it's like a vinyl sticker. This one is from Jungle Vibes, which was one of my favorite sticker books from Happy Planner. How cute is this? Yeah, so this is like a soft vinyl sticker that I'm going to save and put on my water bottles. So I'm just gonna stick that, my little tray there and add that to my water bottle. Okay, I did do two separate orders. So my other order, I didn't receive a vinyl sticker because I got this one first. This is the Villains Collection by Happy Planner. It is a dashboard layout um, and it's 12 month. So I, I don't know if I'm gonna use this, to be quite honest with you. I am a collector when it comes to like some Disney things, um, but mainly I love villains. The villains are my favorite. And again, it's kind of like my thing for, um, let me get this off. My thing for Halloween. I don't know, I just love the villains. They're just su super cool. So this is a mini um, 12 month happy planner and I love using a mini happy planner. It's It's been a while, but I did set up my go wild planner as a mini and so it kind of got me missing using a mini. I typically change them in the summertime like because I'm on the go with the kids and stuff so I typically set up a mini happy planner on the go in the summertime just get this sticky stuff off so I did receive the classic size for Christmas which I haven't used it's a vertical but again I have like the Disney princess classic that came out. I have some of the Mickey ones and it's more of like a collector's thing for me. So I'm not really sure if I'm going to use this one. If I did, I would definitely use this one in my classic. Don't tell my husband, but he, he bought that for me. He's so sweet. Anywho, um, so this is the front. It's got like some foiling to it. It says strong, which I like. That's super cool. And if you're new to happy planner I'll share what the dashboard layout looks like but here's your cover page you can write your name there and that's got Hades from Hercules there's Maleficent and there's your currently page what seems very um, simple so it just says the month of and you can write the month or you can put a sticker there and then you have your holidays and birthdays so like special Dates can go here, but this you can easily wipe this out and make this a memory page or your favorite highlight of the month. So um, a lot of planners use 
there are currently pages for memory keeping or highlighting and things like that, which is a great idea. I haven't done that in quite some time. So there's the cute divider. Okay, so this is undated. I wasn't quite sure. So this is a plus that it is undated and I can start this whenever. So this is the monthly view. It's very clean and it's not too busy. You do have a little male Maleficent quote at the bottom there. And then this is a dashboard if you're new to Happy Planner. So you have like a kind of like a mini horizontal layout here and it's undated. Um, but it goes this way, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. You have to buy errands, calls and emails, bills, which I kind of use, you know, if you guys follow my plans with me, my EC folio, it's a daily and I kind of do the same thing. You know, I kind of categorize it. So I, I used the dashboard last year and I really like it because it, it just works for my planning style or my lifestyle. So I really like it. And you can always white this out to your particular needs. And I like that it's very, there's not a whole lot of color. I mean, they have like these boxes that have like a design to them and some paint splatter here, um, but you can always take washi. I used to do that as well, put washi and repunch it. So that's the dashboard layout. And it seems like the currently pages are all designed the same. So I, now I'm just kind of flipping through and looking at the dividers because I haven't really got to do that with this collection. I do have the classic sticker book. I'm not sure if there was a mini with the Villains collection. Um, there is a big. I don't know if that's still available, but I really wanted the mini. Super cute. Evil Queen Jafar from Aladdin. And then we have Hades, Maleficent, and Jafar. And then Maleficent again. My favorite, Ursula. She's hilarious. And then we have Coella. And then, oh, I love this one. I uh, So this one's my favorite. And I think the big... I don't know if it's a notebook, a Happy Notes, or a big planner. I think it's a Happy Notes, I can't remember. But I love this cover. Uh, we have the Evil Queen from Snow White. Oh uh, yeah, that's the Evil Queen from Snow White. On the cover is Maleficent, okay. And then we have Scar from Lion King. And then Ursula. <laughs> She's just so funny. I, I love her. Um, I do wish they had the evil queen when she turns into the witch. I wish they had like that cover in here when she has like the forbidden apple. So you do get one pages of notes towards the end. Okay, the monthly changes with the villains icon at the bottom with the little quote. It's kind of like their shadow. And then the inside of this planner is black and white stripes, which is nice, and they're both the same. You do get a sheet of stickers to date it. So I'm really happy with this purchase because I love the villains. So again, I use my points for that. And saving the packaging is always great because you can utilize this as a cleared, clear bookmark or your you can DIY dashboard on here. So, okay, I got that. And then my second order, I picked up another sticker book. Let me check if this is part of the new spring release. No, this is last year's. Um, I bought my daughter one of these fuzzy or sherp, sherpas, is that what they're called? I don't know, they're pretty popular. I got her the neutral one. Well, there's three. There's like the rolly um, pencil case one. It's like a mauve pinky color. I was going to get that one too, but I got this one for her. I'll open them in a minute. And then I was really curious about this one. A lot of people talked about it, and I love how, if you guys know LB Novelties on Instagram and YouTube, 
um, Lila, she decorated one for Disney. And I like how she put patches on it. I thought that was a cute idea. So I was just really intrigued by it. It's not white. It definitely has like a vanilla, vanilla, I don't know, ivory, I guess I should say, tint to it. So it's not, it's an off white. It's not a bright white or anything like that. So let me open these up real quick. So they're pretty soft and fuzzy. That's fun. This one's really big. Let me see if I can open this. I hope the zipper's not gonna give me a hard time. Okay, so it does have paper in here. Take that out. And it has like really nice interior lining. I'm very impressed. So it's got like a nice thick lining. It's soft. Wow. So it kind of stands up a little bit. I'm assuming if you put a bunch of stuff in here, it would, it would do really well. This is really cute. I definitely want to put some patches on it. So this one I bought for myself, and this one I bought for my daughter. This is one of the ones with the bands on it, which I, I prefer than the snap-in ones. And I like how they match. The zipper lining matches the outside of the fabric. I don't know. I, I like that kind of detail. So the inside of this one matches and it's super soft. So this one will be for her so she can put on her planner or journal. I know she loves this neutral color. So I got those two. Again, I used my points and then I bought this sticker book. This sticker book is so cute. If you guys know me, you you know that this is me. So this isn't this year's this is last year's release but i don't remember if it was a spring release or sometimes they throw in extra books for back to school too that's not really school related um or this could have been a winter i mean not winter a fall i don't really know but i just know it it says at the bottom here on the back what year it comes out so it was 2021 so this one's very colorful just gonna flip through this real quick like yeah it kind of reminds me um the stephanie fleming sticker books that came out that are my favorites mainly the wellness one i forget what it's called but it has a lot of these cute wellness icons in it and i love those i love the color palette okay so we have boxes which are nice i like that these are plain and you have a variety of sizes, and then we have the clear, cute, like everyday sensual phrases like coffee date, dinner plans, brunch with friends, takeout. Um, these are clear, vacation vibes, sunshine on my mind, water plants, workout, oh, with the watches, this is adorable. That's cute. I would have loved a full page of that. Family day. Ooh, look at these hearts. Weekend getaway. Three day weekend. I love this aesthetic. I love, I've mentioned it many, many times. Black, white with color. Cute. Look at this gradient on these letters. This say feed the piggy. Oh my gosh. So this is kind of like for budgeting. You can make a little tracker for your kids. Um, that would be really cute. Saving for a rainy day, bills due. So this is kind of like a budget page. Then we have these, are these a full sticker? Habit trackers, yeah. So this is like a full sidebar sticker. So if you have that space in your planner, you can do your habits, take some notes on those types of habits. And then you have these headers here. Keep going, um, live creatively. I think that was one of the sticker books that I was talking about with Stephanie Fleming. Really cute. Two pages of those, some more budget stuff. Uh, grocery to buy, I love those. Rest and recharge, girls night out currently planning and then boxes oh I love this 
these are full box paper stickers. These kind of resemble the Happy Planner discs. Then we have some other boxes, paper boxes, and then we have like these peekaboo, or they're for like your monthlies. More of these sidebar boxes with functional boxes. Then we have these, which are really cute. Read a book, date night, go on a walk. This is a really, I love this sticker book. Celebrate, birthday sticker, stickers. Cute. Okay, these are fun. Do all the things today to do, shine bright, get busy. And then we have them in black with a colorful outline. Then we have some full quote vertical boxes. And then some checklist. And then more quote vertical boxes, which are in the front. This is really cute. I'm really happy with this purchase. So this is called Happy Plans. Okay, so that was everything from Happy Planner. Okay, let's do Hobby Lobby since it's really small. So I picked up this sticker book. Um, it was on clearance. This I bought a while when I was shopping for Go Wild table mate gifts, and it was on clearance for $4.49. They had a lot of stuff on clearance. It was like their big spring clearance thing that happens all the time. I didn't buy too much. It's kind of just focusing on looking for what I needed to get there, but I couldn't pass this up. This was, I do collect the Agenda 52 sticker books and I don't have this one. And plus it was on Clarence. Okay, so this one's called Motivational and it's foiled, it's 30 sheets got icons the colors are my jam these are so fun we have some flags these are all paper some checklist um, some fun headers kind of got two pages of those and then we have some quotes appointments oh, I'm kind of going too fast here just a variety of boxes and like border stickers. And it has like the foiling to it. It's got like a retro vibe. I love the quotes. Yeah, so you get like two pages of each. And so far everything's paper. It kind of gives me a da Damask love vibe. Her kind of aesthetic. I love Damask Love. And so these are clear stickers with the foiling and you have like weights, grocery shopping, tea or coffee. Um, you know, if you have a dentist appointment, check email icon and then the rainbows, some clocks, two pages of those. And then here's some like deco elements, super fun. There's another page of that one. Then some fun alphabets. Ooh, these are fun. These are like neon alphabets. Cute, some more deco. This is a really cute sticker book, so I'm glad I got this one. Again, that's called Motivational. So that was from Hobby Lobby. And then from Erin Condren, and then I'll do the Etsy shop order. I got the planner folio i've been seeing this a lot and i just really wanted to try it so it's 9 by 11 and it's neoprene and you can get this customized so i'm gonna go ahead and open this okay so this is my very first folio and i think they've had these for a while and this is by the collection edivy and i i got a couple of her stuff from the ec dinner party that i went to here in California um, at the EC store in Irvine. And I don't know, I was just intrigued by this online. So we'll see how this works. I wanna see if it fits, what other planners can fit in here. Now I do see off the bat that this is, the zipper part is kind of a struggle. 
I thought that maybe there was like a cardboard in here that was making it harder, but it's actually this. So it has this um, divider in here that is sectioned to put in, I'm assuming stickers or um, other planner accessory things, pens maybe. And it has like this elastic. It's kind of like the elastic that's on the planty packs of Erin Condren's little pin cases. And this is in rose gold. I think this is called Bliss. Is the artwork maybe? But I mainly got it to see if it would fit. Okay, I'm gonna take this bucket down. How would it would fit a life planner or like a classic happy planner that I have. Or, I mean, just a classic size planner. Okay, so this fits nicely in here. This is so nice. I love this. But we'll definitely have to test it out. I'll have a setup video later, but um, on this pouch thing, I was just really intrigued to see it in person. It's really nice. It has Erin Condren embossed on the back. I can only tell in the pictures, but I also want to see... Okay, I have a classic happy planner here. This is my devotional planner. And I thought also this would be great to take to a Bible study. Keep it protected. Oh, wow. That's so pretty. Again, you can customize these. Um, I had my name put on the bottom. But I mean, like... There's like options to change the color. You can add a photo. Of course, you can put, you know, your women's Bible study down here group or something. Oh, this is so cool. I love this. Okay, so this fits a classic size. I'm gonna put one more planner in here. This is my social media planner. It's kind of like a classic size, but it's a wrong, wrong planner. I think hers is a little bit, just a tad bigger. Yeah, I can tell it's just a tad bigger, but it does fit. It did close. Oh, I have some color that is rubbing off the zipper. It's okay, it kind of looks cool that way. So I'll have to set this up and see how it works with filling up these pockets and putting a planner in it. Definitely, if you guys have used this, um, let me know what you've put in here and how long it's last for you and stuff like that. It's really pretty though. I love this artwork by Edeby. Okay, cool, I'm happy with that. Okay, lastly, I have a small order. Okay, so I have a cute little freebie here. And I talked about I wanted to order more weather stickers from her. So from her, I have cute weather stickers, but I talked about I needed the sunny ones. So that's why I kind of put this order in. So here's her little freebie sample. It's green. I'm thinking maybe for March. So it has reading time. A lot of different reading element stickers. This is a little promotion card to receive alerts and new releases. And then this is her shop name, Nicole Hutch Designs. Cute, this is a little quote card. This would be cute with to paint, really. That's really cute. Her order is in between these two um, thick cardboard, so that's nice. All right, so I kind of ordered a lot of different things this time. So this is the mini stickers that I normally get. So I got two of the sunny stickers for my weather. I love tracking the weather. Then I decided to get um, some of her larger stickers. Oh, I have some mini ones in here. Let's see. Do I have more? Okay, they're like hidden. So I have these little scripts that say today. 
I have some birthday balloons. These are perfect for my Erin Condren because I'm just gonna pull this one out in front of me. I mean, I do have my planner to the side over there, but so the Erin Condren Daily has a smaller monthly view. And so these mini stickers are gonna fit perfectly for birthdays. I can either put them here or I can note them on the side. So love that. All right, so I've got these, um, these are like new stickers. They're called flat lays. I haven't really used stickers like this, but I did get some stickers in like a, at, at Go Wild, it's a planner conference and um, people were giving out like swaps and things. So I, I don't know, I'm kind of intrigued by them. I just don't know how I would implement them in my planner spreads just yet, but I think these would make good monthly goal stickers. So kind of like a motivational inspiration flat lay sticker for my monthly goals. So that's what I had in mind for these stickers. And I just love that they're monochromatic because I love rainbows. So I love that each one is its own little color. So super cool. Um, a lot of stuff I got is like fitness training and things because that's like my main favorite thing to plan. So I have strength training. I love the scripty on this one. I got cardio workout, because I like to have a goal of like 45 minutes. I love the shoes. Um, this was in her clearance section, so it's just a mixture of just essential stickers, like vacation, nail appointment, hair appointment. I just love the colors, so I purchased those. These I got for my daughter's track meets, so I can um, use these for my monthly view, again, to track all her track meets, because I do have softball stickers, but I don't have anything related to track. So I got those, and these are all you know, individually cut, super nice, great quality. Um, I got some cleaning stickers, time to clean, with the icon. She offers like with icon, without icon, just icon, stickers, um, get it done. There's a cute little header. Walk on the treadmill. I really liked this one. I love that. I love like extra specialty stickers like that. Um, work out at the gym and I love all the, you know, the weights, with the colors. Uh, another flat lay. This is like... Um, a working vibe so I could use these for goals to tackle each month and then I got I think these were clearanced um, these are happy birthday so that is my order from her I really like her shop she offers a lot and just a little tip when you're actually looking for a certain type of sticker definitely utilize the search bar <laughs> And because when you come to a sticker shop and they just offer a lot, um, it can be a little overwhelming, but that's what that little search section's for. So you can find what you're looking for. It's kind of a helpful tip to navigate if you are new to buying some stickers off a new shop. That's what I have to do sometimes. I'm like, oh, I'm new to this website or how to navigate this. like. Let me just start off by what I usually use every single day. Okay, so love her shop, totally recommend it. So that was my order, some of the things that I've purchased for the spring. Um, I do have some other things coming. I ordered um, some spring washi from Simply Gilded, um, and then some things from Erin Condren. Um, I was waiting for a certain folio color to come in and it finally came in. So I'm really excited about that. But thanks so much for taking the time out of your day to watch this planner haul video with me. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'm gonna have fun playing with all my new planner pouches. I'm just a sucker for planner pouches. I'm such a bag lady. I have two new Happy Planner sticker books. It's been a while, so I'm super excited about these two. Super cute to add to my collection. And we shall see what I do with this mini Happy Planner. But as always, I thank you guys for watching and I will see you in my next video. Take care, stay safe, and happy planning. Bye.